Yo, what's up? Welcome back again. Today we are going to be doing something different and today we are going to be listening to music. And uh, what kind of music? Uh, roots reggae music because it's my favorite. And I'm going to be checking out this group, the Congos. This is prob probably one of the most uh, one of the best groups that we have uh, still surviving in uh, roots reggae music because uh, one thing that i like about them is uh, this guy cedric Mitton. he he has this a uh, unique sound that i uh, i don't know how he came up with that kind of sound because um, to my knowledge no one else in reggae music has uh, has been able to uh, to go anywhere near this kind of a uh, sound so it's a uh, it makes this group unique because, uh, yeah, as I say, it's their group. So it means they have different voices. But for this guy, he brings out that, you know, uniqueness. It makes the whole thing come out uh, unique. And so we are going to listen to the Ark of the Covenant. And this is a live. This is played live. So let's hear this out. Yeah, and I must say, before they go on, I must say that the, the sound quality is good. Uh, <laughs> and remember, this is a live recording, so I must commend the sound engineers for what they have done, because the sound quality is quite good. It's not what you'd expect of a live performance, but anyway, let's continue. Wow, uh, you can hear uh, Cedric Mitton. In case you don't know who I'm talking about, I'm talking about the guy in the far left. I don't know if if it's your left or my left, but I'm talking about the guy with the high pitch tone. And you can hear, you can feel that uh, his voice makes you. T it gives this uh, this group, you know, as you can see, these guys have, oh, there are four guys here, but each one of them has a, a unique voice. And they, they kind of complement each other because as as they are going in and out of the, you know, the, the main thing, the Ark of the Covenant, you know, you can hear how each of their voices uh, is uh, playing part in that. So, and then uh, Cedric goes on with the high high tone, <laughs> and for a moment there you might think that uh, he might uh, he he's almost he, his uh, voice might uh, might betray him, but he's so perfect even at at his age because I, I think he must be in his seventies or something. Even at his age, that voice has still remained the same. If you listen to their song. Uh, to the, most of their songs even from the 80s this guy's voice is the same it has not even changed a, a little bit so I, I like I, I like how that does to the whole uh, to the whole sound
and I, I must say I also like what the band is doing because I, if you listen to the original tune, I, they have I made it better, you know, uh, because the original one was obviously made in the in the I think in the eighties or something. Uh, so it was kind of uh, you know it had those uh, uh, you know at that time the kind of music they were producing. So they have just uh, you know made it a little better, and then they are not overdoing it. You know, sometimes uh, it happens that with these live bands, they tend to overdo the the instruments, and it makes the, the song even feel as if it's not the same song. But this one, and then they are maintaining, they are not just, the drama is not going crazy on the drums to try to, to make, uh, no, uh, it feels, this is what is uh, real, authentic, roots reggae music. It's like the drama doesn't go crazy on the drums. The guy on the piano, the guys on the guitars, the guys on the percussion, the, no one is going crazy. They're just, and this is the beauty of, uh, as I said, the beauty of uh, roots reggae music. It's just cool, you, you know, you can feel the, the, the originality. It's just, you know, they, they maintain that kind of tune that lives for, decades and decades and this is why even even the new generation you can still find people who just grow up and they were born the other day but they still find some of these songs uh, very entertaining and very enjoyable to listen to so anyway <laughs> let's talk <laughs> let me stop talking let's just listen yeah rockers Congo's International. I don't know how these uh, engineers are doing that, but <laughs> you can feel the echo when the guy is speaking. It's just like the <laughs> the eighties, how they were doing it on the records. <laughs> you know, when they they do the song and then at the end they do the the drum and bass style and then they dub. You know, they had that echo thing, <laughs> which gives it this uh, you know party party feeling. But uh, you know, it's uh, very nice. Nicely done, clean, neat, short, no, uh, nothing, uh, they are not uh, milking it. You know, there are those guys with uh, one, uh, uh, they might have several hit songs, but whenever they are, uh, they are playing the, you know, their main hit song, they tend to milk it and, you know, rewind. And, <laughs> and the guys on the east instruments, they go crazy there. Everyone is not concentrating and the sound comes out of it's not good. But this one you can see it's clean, neat, it's short, 
and you get to enjoy it because it sounds the same as uh, if we are playing it uh, the original song from the from their album and this is as they say this is the beauty of uh, roots reggae music they can preserve that sound and uh, make it you know it's authentic they don't have as you can see they are performing they are very they're enjoying themselves they are not struggling they are not no no struggling to keep up with the beats or struggling to you know you know there are some songs that you have to be very technical and you have to be very keen when you are you're performing these kinds of songs but for this one you, you can see it's just freestyle and they are just it comes out just naturally and you get to enjoy it because uh, even uh, looking at this you can just see how you know you you get that uh, is yeah you is out <laughs> and you get to enjoy the the music is that it uh, is that the end yeah yeah, yeah i think yeah 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 man original original yeah yeah nice people yeah. Yeah, man, you see when Congos come, I come we come to nice it up, you know? Original yeah, people. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Why not? Revolutionary people. Rastafari. Yeah, you see, a short performance, clean, nice, you get to enjoy it. So, this group, uh, if you don't listen to them, I can uh, recommend to you, or if you are exploring uh, uh, reggae music. You can check this group out. They are one of the best groups when it comes to even like a live performance. I know some of the great artists. When they are performing, they tend to be kind of... Uh, you don't get, get to enjoy it so much. I don't want to give some examples. But uh, anyway, because every artist have their style. But this one, I like them because when they are performing, especially for Cedric, they are very authentic. They come out almost the same as when they're in the studio. But uh, anyway, go and check them out. And uh, if you have any other artists that you would uh, like me to check out, because as I said, I'm a very big fan of uh, Roots Reggae music, kindly uh, recommend them to me. So let me know what you think about this in the comments. If you have not subscribed, kindly do. And uh, till next time, stay safe. Peace.